Well, good afternoon. Um, it's that time of year. You can feel it in the air. The fall is here. The leaves are starting to change color. Um, you know, it's the there, there's I swear there's pumpkin spice in the air, and the reason for that is because uh, my wife actually took pumpkins and juiced them, and now she's putting them in the in the diffuser. No, I'm I'm, I'm just joking. She's not really doing that, but. Uh, <laughs> Uh, you know, it's, it's just it's something magical about this time of year. You know, you get kind of, you're starting to see the end of summer and just the excitement of what's going on and the kids get so excited about candy and that kind of stuff. Now, there's all, always at this time of year, there's a lot of questions about Halloween and that kind of stuff. Um, some people feel like maybe it's uh, immoral to celebrate um, uh, Halloween. Some people feel like it's immoral to even use the word Halloween. Um, and before we even go anywhere with this, I just want to say this. That the Bible says that God made God made the day. So there's no such thing as an evil day. Right? <laughs> this is the day that the Lord has made, is what the Bible says. So it really, a lot of that is um, traditions and kind of the baseless claims. There's a lot of people who don't really know history too well, and so then they'll make these grand claims about history um, as far as, uh, you know, um, Halloween being evil and that kind of stuff. So so that, that takes us to the name um, Harvest Fest. Now, where does this come from? Um, if you are familiar with churches, you'll oftentimes see around Halloween time that they'll have these signs that say Harvest Fest on it. And if you say, uh, is that what you do for Halloween? They'll, they'll get kind of touchy and say, Harvest Fest. Um, especially with the, with older people, and so so I mean let, let's th let's think about this. Is there anything wrong with that? Well, harvest fest is a general term. W what that means is that it, it's not really a, a thing. It's more of like it's kind of like saying holiday. It's not there. There isn't really a holiday called hol holiday. Does that make sense? And that's kind of what's happening with harvest fest. Um, Harvest Fest is not really a thing. See, a lot of cultures throughout history have had um, festivals during harvest time. These were harvest festivals. Harvest Fest. That, that's where, the, where, where churches get that name from. But here's the thing. Um, obviously, these were not Christian. <laughs> now, it, it's, people go back and forth as to whether Halloween developed from as an adaptation like the church said hey this is fun but we want something that's more christian and less ghostly and demonic and that kind of stuff so let's have our own thing or whether it just developed on its own people kind of argue a lot about it ultimately we don't know but what we do know is that the church had a uh, a holiday that, that was called um all hollows day now what what a hollow is as far as i understand is it's like a saint Hallow is a saint. So All Hallows Day is All Saints Day. Um, this is this is the first of November, and it's to celebrate, you know, all the all the, all the saints, known and unknown. Okay, so there, there's that. But so then that takes us to Halloween, which is All Hallows Eve, Halloween. Okay, so uh, this is is the name. This is the funny part. Okay, the name Halloween is actually a Christian word. Uh, Christians invented it, <laughs> so I mean, if, if you're if you're saying, "Oh man, you know, Halloween, ooh, that's evil," actually, no, it's not. Um, it, it's it's a word that's Christian. The the funny thing is, is that Harvest Fest is less Christian than Halloween <laughs> because Harvest Fest is more of a general term, meaning a festival at, ha at harvest time. Um, so you know, there's there's that. Um, so so that takes us to you know. What's the deal with this? What, what should we use? Honestly, it really doesn't matter. Um, use whatever works best in your community. Some people are going to know it as, as Halloween. Some people are going to know it as Harvest Fest. Uh, you know, there's no reason in starting a fight about this kind of stuff. Um, there's a lot of stuff that, you know, um, may, maybe are worth arguing and fighting and kind of getting nasty about, but probably not. Um, I, don't really, I don't really think that there's <laughs> much that would qualify for that. But uh, Halloween isn't one of those things. Um, don't let this be something that, that, that divides you from others. If, if somebody says Harvest Fest, eh, let it go. It doesn't matter if they, you know, get offended by that. If somebody says Halloween, eh, let it go. I mean, don't, don't get offended about stupid stuff. Uh, there's plenty of stuff that, that people are actually getting offended about. There's no reason to add another thing. It's just, eh, it's not worth it. It's kind of a waste of time. Um, 
So as far as, is the day evil? No, there's, God made all the days. Um, don't do anything evil on Halloween, but that has nothing to do with, with the day itself. Um, you know, and, and I, I understand that some people think that, um, you know, the whole candy and trick-or-treat and pumpkins are, are bad or whatever. If, if somebody's offended by it, eh, it's fine. You know what I mean? You don't, you don't have to live your life to, to impress everybody else. Um, there, there's nothing, you know, historically evil <laughs> with dressing up or with carving pumpkins or with, with getting candy. I mean, it's a fun, it's a fun time. It's, it's harmless. You know, it's not something that is inherently evil. Now, just because some people have a pagan festival and they will use something similar doesn't mean that it is the same, okay? Um, for instance, uh, the priests of the Old Testament would dress up. They would wear certain things uh, to minister in the tabernacle in the in the in the in the to 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 worship god and um surely it's not evil to dress up see what i mean uh, because then the priests of god would have been sinning so i mean with that being said this is what it comes down to there's a lot of stupid stuff to fight about and this is one of them um there's nothing wrong with using the word halloween it's a christian word um harvest fest is just a general term um, and it's okay if you don't see eye to eye with other people and they don't see eye to eye, eye, to eye with you. It's, it's fine. It's not, not, a, not a big deal. Um, if you are a church wondering whether you should reach out and love people, the answer is always yes. <laughs> you can call it whatever the heck you want to call it. Uh, whatever they want. It doesn't matter. It's, it's not something to, to fight about. And as far as the day itself, no, it is not evil. <laughs> as far as the things itself, um, none of those things are evil. Um, there are some things that are evil, but <laughs> I'm not going to mention them because this is just kind of looking at the idea of what is Harvest Fest. Um, in the next couple uh, couple days, I'll post uh, a blog that I that I had written uh, actually a little while ago, um, probably two or three years ago, uh, giving more historical context on, on that. And uh, so, if this was helpful and encouraging for you, don't feel like you're, you're sinning if you celebrate Halloween. Um, don't feel like you know. You have to abstain from it. I mean, it's, it's, <laughs> some people are just easily offended. That's okay. You know, just, that, that's fine for them. Just, you, you keep serving God and you keep, you keep uh, with a good attitude and, and it, it, it's fine. It's not, once again, the, the, the big takeaway here is, is, uh, you know, just don't, don't let people convince you that, that <sighs> just all kinds of nonsense. It's just not worth fighting about. Um, I hope you guys have a great fall season. Um, I know I'm, I, I'm, I'm really excited for Halloween. Um, uh, the kids are always, they're always, they always love it. Um, then Thanksgiving, oh my gosh, but, you know, Christmas, okay, all right, but this is, the, this is the big highlight here, guys. New Year's Eve is coming. What? That's gonna be fun. Uh, probably my favorite time of the year is this, this time. So, okay, um, I hope that that was helpful. I hope it was encouraging. Um, I hope it kind of, you know, and I'm not trying to start a fight here. So if, if you listen to this and you, you, you oh, oh, well, let me just stop you right there. I'm, I'm not going to argue with you about it. I just gave you the historical context. You can you can choose to ignore history. That that's your that's your call. I, I'm not going to argue about it. Um, once again, I, I think that there's too much stuff dividing us. And my point is to just try and bring a little bit of reconciliation here. It's, it's, it's really, it's, it's okay. I mean, you got some Christians who feel like, you know, they're super duper spiritual because they don't call it Halloween and they don't, they don't do anything on Halloween. It's like, oh, okay. <laughs> um, but anyways, so, so have a great rest of the day, guys. See ya.